beginning with the realization that there's a lot of suffering in this world and the value of compassion in um, engaging the world in a way that is fundamentally practical. I would look out into the world and I wouldn't think so much about myself, but I'd see so much suffering that it weighed my heart down. A world without empathy is a very dead world. We're dead to each other. But if our empathy is uh, unregulated, if we're experiencing uh, empathic distress, we can collapse. The next thing that arose for me and that I think has been helpful for you know, quite a few people is turning attention toward one's own, quote, subjectivity, to one's own mind. And the, the mind stream becomes uh, less divided. We begin to see the self is not this small little kind of singularity that we're operating out of. And to begin to actually engage in mind training in such a way that uh, one begins to settle down. You know, which I really learned from working in the prison system, that every individual has the capacity to awaken from suffering. And inside uh, there, no matter how narcissistic, there is goodness inside this person. And that's what you go for, not excluding the truth of their delusion.